Hi, I'm Matt Riggs. And I'm Leo Kovalik. And you're back for another Train Talk. Now, Matt, last time got a little bit rough. We kind of got off topic there. You know what? We did, and you were really upset with me. So, uh, over the last few months, I've been riding the rails of Northwest Pennsylvania. Actually, they just have one rail, so I've been riding the same train over and over again. But uh, I feel like I've learned a lot. Excellent. You look great, too. Thank you very much. I've, uh, I've, I've learned how to dress like a conductor, and hopefully learned how to talk like one. Excellent. Yes. Trains hit Hey Soul Sister has recently been steamrolling ahead <laughs> in popularity due to the fact it's been in Samsung's new 3D TV ads. Oh, those are good. I can't wait to get me one of them. Ah. Probably the saddest moment I ever had actually happened on television. Uh, it was the day that they replaced Ringo Starr with George Carlin on Shiny Time Station. <sighs> it's Shiny Time Station. Okay. It's Thomas the Tank Engine. Okay. I mean, it's, right. it's, it's, it's getting there. Train had a non-album song, Ordinary, in the hit movie Spider-Man 2. Oh, that was that was a good movie. Speaking Excellent. of uh, non-album stuff, mm -hmm. uh, I mentioned Ringo Starr earlier. Yeah. Uh, I don't know if he's ever done a train. Well, uh, he did in the Beatles' first movie, so nix that. But um, I love his solo stuff. If you listen to his solo stuff, he has a yeah. song Photograph that's really good. It's not the Verve Pipe song. But it's just like, it's really good. I was actually listening to it on my way here on the iPod, on the train. Ah. I was a little afraid you weren't going to mention anything. No, it was on the train. It was on the CTA train. Okay. So I was listening. My iPod is amazing, by the way. It's, it's thousands of songs. In November of 2006, the band Train took a three-year hiatus to be with friends and family. I spent most of the last three months in a mental institution. Holy crap. Well, what? Yeah. D yeah. Don't look at me like that's okay. Why? Well, I'm better now. But... <clears throat> Train was recently the house band in the ABC hit show Dancing with the Stars. <laughs> I love celebrities. I didn't mention this earlier, but that three months in a mental institution was court ordered because uh, I got in trouble for stalking three different celebrities. Would you like to know who they are? No, I, I want to know. Would you like to know who they are? Sure. If all right. Well, the first one was Fabio, which was all done online. I didn't know that you could cyberstalk somebody. That's a new word in my lingo. Uh, the next one was Ian Ziering. Do you remember him? He was on no. Dancing with the Stars. He was also on 90210. He's spent a lot of time at his house since then because he doesn't act anymore, and I know where he lives. And then the last one, oddly enough, uh, one of my favorites, Ringo Starr. He was a conductor on Shiny Time Station. I, I, I've been Leo Kovalik. I still am Matt Riggs. And this has been the last episode ever of Train Talk. No, we're going to do a few more probably. I quit. Why do you quit? I qu we need to get you help. I'm fine. I'm out of the hospital. Things In are good. Back to stalking stars? No, no, that was all before. No, I'm, I haven't stalked anybody in months. <laughs>